I'm Clint Griffiths with today's Ag Day Minute. The extreme heat is breaking records in Europe, but it's also causing problems for crops. In Italy, experts say the hot and dry conditions could wipe out a third of the season's harvest of rice and corn. Prolonged triple digits are hurting wheat crops in France, and the European Union, which produces almost 18% of the world's wheat, has cut its estimate for one wheat crop by roughly 5 million tons from an earlier prediction. Some welcome relief at the pump. Gas for less than $4 a gallon is back, at least in some areas. Nearly one in five gas stations is charging under $4 for a gallon of regular gas. That's about 24,000 stations nationwide, mostly in the southeast. Now, overall, the national average has fallen 10% or 50 cents since hitting record high of 502 a gallon seven weeks ago. A new study says there's no evidence linking refined grain intake with a risk of developing type 2 diabetes. They can be found in things like bread, cereals, and pastries. The research was conducted by the College of Health Solutions at Arizona State University. Now, it's based its findings on studies that were conducted on 11 different populations of adults totaling 400,000 people. The lead researcher concluding that these grains are much healthier than people give them credit for. For more Ag News, watch Ag Day weekdays on the station anytime on agweb.com.